Welcome to Stock Talk. This is Scott, your host. Uh, we're going to look at a stock today, MPC, uh, Marathon Petroleum Corporation. They're an oil refinery. Been tracking this one a long time as well. Uh, so let's kind of look at the stock. Then we're going to uh, one of the screens out of TD Ameritrade on how you make a trade with this stock. Let's take a look at it here. It's currently 56.89. I just bought some shares of this last week, somewhere probably in the uh, 58 range, somewhere around there. What I like to do on the stock is, um, you see, this is I've got a one year chart pulled up on this one right now. This is what I call support levels. When you see these dips and it gets out of that dip, uh, that's a support level to me. These are support levels at the top, resistance levels as well, because it couldn't go any higher. And then you've got another support level there. But you can see if I put that line straight across, pretty good level. You can see where it has gotten down to that level before and bounced. Now it's gone a little bit below it this time. So again, you can never pick the tops. You can never pick the bottoms on these things. Very, very seldom you get that lucky. Uh, this is also, I would call this a little support here. Uh, and of course, it came out both times on this one here. It's hit it twice. It's the 45 range and uh, came out of both of those pretty good. Um, so that's what I look at. Uh, last week, I'm, I started seeing this thing uh, have some down days. I'm usually looking back five days. So I, when I see something going down for like five days, watch on often, and the market's not going down every day, uh, a lot of times I'll come in and, and I'll purchase, start purchasing shares. So last week I did that with this one. I think I purchased uh, around 58 or so. Uh, we're at 56.89, so I'm down a little bit on this one. Uh, but that's okay. Uh, that happens. Uh, you don't, like I said, you don't pick the tops and you don't pick the bottoms. Um, so what I want to do next is I want to go ahead and I want to show you a screen in our TD Ameritrade. Let's see if I can do this right. Okay, let's see here. I've got a little portion of it picked out here. Get um, this is actually in my account right now. Uh, I just got the screen showing just a very portion of the screen so you can see what it looks like to make the trade. The first thing you do here is you have an action. You've gone, you go to trade and you pick uh, that, that you want to make a trade in your stocks. Uh, you've got something here called action. Of course, action, buy or sell. Uh, in this case, I would say, let's say buy. And then you put in here the quantity that you want to buy. Let's say you wanted to go get a, a couple hundred shares of that stock or a hundred, let's just say a hundred, just to keep it simple. And you put in there MPC. Okay. And what I do is I always do a limit trade. Limit trade is when you actually put the price that you want to buy that stock at. Uh, let's say it's, uh, let's say, let's say the stock, what was it? It was $57 or something, 56 89 I think it was. So let's say I wanted to buy that stock if it hits $56. So I put in the $56 there. So when that stock dips down to 56, this order should fill. Uh, you see here the time and force, that GTC, that means sold and it plus extended hours. I don't usually trade in extended hours. Some weird stuff happens sometimes in those hours. I just don't like to fool with it. I usually just do a day trade. Uh, that's when all the that's when all the trading is going on. Uh, and you can, you know, you put a price out there and it's, you know, it gets there, uh, within time if it's, if it's heading that direction. So that's, that's it. You would have that. And you, there's a button below there that says review order. You would click that, uh, screen's going to come up and let you review what you've got in there. You want to make sure you've got to buy 100 shares there. You got the symbol correct, the limit order. $56 and it's going to tell you that's going to be a $5,600 trade and then uh, you can uh, okay the order and that order will be placed and when that stock dips to that amount then uh, you would be in good shape there and uh, that trade would go through if once it hits that amount. So that's what I like. I like the limit trades. They've got other kind of trades. you got a market trade. When you do a market trade that means uh, whatever the market is, whatever that you know, whatever that price is, you put that order out there, 
those orders are going to fill based off what price is at that time when that, when that order hits the market. So I don't like to do that. I like to always try to get it below whatever the price is running at. So, so you're getting a little bit of a discount right off the bat. Um, again, it's hard to pick the bottoms. It's hard to pick the tops on these things when you're selling them. But uh, you, you'll get uh, your rhythm down. Again, I'm just looking for stocks that I know something about that I watch. I don't, I don't just go and buy a stock that's down, you know, 10%. I, I've got to know that I've been watching that stock. I, and I look at those charts, those support levels, those kind of things. So next stock, next video, what we'll do is we'll talk about a, uh, a stock that if you're just starting, uh, it may be a good one for you to, to uh, get involved with. Um, it's a, it, it doesn't cost that much per share. And, uh, it's a high risk stock though. That I want you to know that right off the bat is very high risk. It's a pharmaceutical stock. Uh, they've got some things going on. We'll talk about that in the next video. Don't forget to like this video. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Don't forget to tell your friends about the channel, uh, especially friends of yours that, that you know that want to start selling stocks. Um, and uh, we'll just build a community and, and uh, all help each other out. And hopefully you can avoid some of the mistakes that I've made in the future. Okay. Well, you have a great day and uh, happy trading to you. And we'll talk next time about that stock. Okay. Have a great day.